Uh, okay, uh, welcome. Um, I'm Dr. Ahmed Abdelaziz. Uh, I will be with you here in this lesson uh, to give you a tutorial on how to make the text classification using Weka. Uh, okay, uh, now we will open, starting by opening the Weka program. As you can see here, this GUI contains of four buttons. The most important one is Explorer, as you can see here on this screen. Um, first of all, uh, we need to load the training file uh, that contains some sentences and the uh, assigned class uh, to each one. Uh, okay, uh, now we're, we will open the file. Okay, uh, this is the training file. Uh, okay, as we can see here, uh, the format of the training weaker file contains of uh, our name of that relation, which is sentiment. Okay, and we have two attributes, I mean two columns. Uh, the number one is uh, for sentence, and uh, this is a string data type. And the uh, second one is for class. As we mentioned in the first uh, moment in this lesson, we have uh, to classify our sentences into one of the three classes um, positive we label positive as one zero um, for neutral and two for negative then uh, the last attribute is is for data and our data is co consists of a group of uh, sentences as we can see here uh, in this example and each sentence labeled as one class for example we have one um, uh, positive sentence like nice or oh, this is beautiful and uh, we have an example of neutral sentences like I came back home which is zero and also we have an example of uh, the negative sentences like bad news uh, and it's assigned to uh, two. Okay, uh, this is the training file that contains um, some of the uh, statements and each statement um, assigned to uh, one of the three classes, uh, positive, uh, negative and uh, neutral. So we click on open. Okay, then uh, if we don't have any error in this file and the file is already um, corrected, uh, formatted, uh, then you will not find any uh, error message comes from the Wika Explorer. So uh, as we can see here, the training file contains uh, two columns, sentences and class. Uh, it's very important to know that uh, the weaker does not know or recognize which column is for class. So we need to tell weaker uh, to uh, that this column, I mean column two, is for class. How to do that? <clears throat> In the filter, we have to choose the unsupervised attributes. And from attributes, we have a lot of filters. Uh, from this uh, uh, great options, we will um, select our class assigner. So class assigner now is, uh, it means that uh, the, f the second column in this file, I mean in the training file, is uh, considered and a class. So then we, uh, after that, check this column and then uh, press apply. Now. After assigning um, the second column uh, as a class, uh, now we need um, to classify this uh, training uh, sentences into um, our uh, three classes. Uh, so we will uh, click on classify and then on the classify we uh, have to uh, select uh, the one a classifier that combine the classification and filter together. So if we click on the choose, we will find many options. Under meta, we have 
a classifier called filter classifier. This is a suitable uh, classifier that combines classification and the filter process together. Then close. In the test options, we have many options, as you can see here in this uh, uh, screen. Uh, so we will use um, uh, the option use training set because it is very small data set. So uh, by selecting the filter classifier and use training set, we are ready to classify our training file into our three classes. But before that, we have uh, to do some uh, configurations uh, on the classifier. 